Hello everyone, welcome to a Samson daily run. It is Wednesday. What a nice day. It's halfway through the week. 25 cents, good start. Now we can buy something. We need a key. I'm feeling in a video gamey mood. I'm on a video game high because I have just come from recording two Darkest Dungeon episodes that were not shit. So I feel good about that. We have got a key, so we could just go straight to the shop right now and see if we can get an amazing head start. Yes! Thank you. This is perfect. I think I'll buy the Spirit Heart at the end of the level. Maybe I'll buy the Habit. It depends on how much money we get between now and then. Um, the, the Sack Head, Sack Point, Sack Head, yeah. I thought it could get through there and I couldn't. It was lucky that there was nothing chasing me in particular. Um, is going to give us a lot more sacks, obviously, and the sacks will pay out with way more stuff, e.g. coins and consumables of all forms, plus batteries. Get a decent space bar right, and that will really go a long way. Hopefully, maybe more cards. If we can get... There's a sack now. A bomb. It's really good. If we can get... Um, more temperance cards to get on more blood banks we can really take advantage of the fact that samson starts with bloody lust and therefore does more damage as he takes more damage by you know causing ourselves to take damage for a good cause i.e we swap our blood for money pick up the consumables as a result many of which i believe can be sacks but oh, we didn't get any uh extra damage advantage out of this floor, but we do have the chariot card, which I'm not going to keep for very long, because it's going to help us out, but I think I'm going to hope to, on the next floor, get a uh, an arcade, which means I'm only going to buy the spirit heart, and I'm not going to buy... I might not even buy the spirit heart, I'm going to buy... If I buy the spirit heart, if I buy anything, I'll buy the spirit heart, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, I'm not going to buy the habit, because although it's a really decent item, I think it's much more worthwhile having the chance of having an arcade and therefore a blood bank on the next floor. Although knowing this game, if I get an arcade on the next floor, it's going to be a fucking um, bed or something bullshit like that. <clears throat> and we're really not doing very much damage having not taken any on this floor. I mean, this fight's taking forever. I'm tempted to use a chariot card just to make it over. Please spawn next to your own bombs. That's more like it. Now, more HP is fine in my humble opinion. We do have a bomb, but I'm not confident I could find the secret room with it. So I'm not going to look. We can find a secret room on another floor. There wasn't the curse room to get into or anything, so there is an arcade. I did buy the spirit heart. I basically forgot. <laughs> uh, we'll do some damage to ourselves just to get a damage bonus. Where did that extra coin come from? I don't know. We'll go up to 15, 15 cents. I was going to then use the chariot card to do the rest of it. That was probably a bad idea. If we feel we need to, we can use the chariot card. Oh, okay, perfect. That was actually really worth doing. Strength card is okay, but I'm going to keep the chariot in case we find another another useful reason for it. Our damage is immense, by the way, so even though I have gone down to fairly weak HP, you know, we're one shot in basically everything on this floor now, so it's honestly not a huge concern. We two-shot that. That's a pretty annoying spider, and we two-shot it, so that's also fine with me. All these... Uh, Sacks are outrageous, mind you. And of course, <coughs> excuse me, we've actually managed to get ourselves into a position where we can get into this room, which is also really good. And the damage we're doing to these gurglings, then, they're not even putting up a fight. Come on now. Put yourself a boss. Now, I do have the IV back, which is, as Samson, a really good item. Because at any point that we want to, we basically can use the blood bank. We've got 100% uh, blood. Now, it can't pay out with the can't pay out with anything, I suppose I should say. Like, it can't give us the IV bag, but it also can't give us a blood bag. Which is something that we'd be kind of happy to pick up. Because the more HP we have, the more damage we can do to ourselves. That was a very useful tinted drop, because it did have... Oh, more bombs is nice too. It had the spirit heart in it, and... Uh, do I care? Not really. Could there be a secret room here? No, but we can get this, so I will. Kind of want to keep the IV bag. I always confuse Mr. Boom with homing bombs, making me think I'm getting five bombs, but in fact I'm getting a, a bomb spacebar item. And you're going to have to do better than that if you want me to replace my current spacebar item game, because 
IV bag of Samson is outrageous. Again, we're going here. Sure. We'll take this. <laughs> okay. We didn't get anything from it except for two keys, but in the future when we open a chest, we're going to get way more stuff. This feels like a secret room. <laughs> Call it a hunch. Look at all these things, though. It's amazing. We should take this pill, because we're going to see several more pills in the future. It's relaxed, which is not brilliant, but it's not awful. The moon will find our other secret room. We should see if there's a curse room. I doubt it. There is not, but we can use the devil card on our boss, which is going to be a damage upgrade to get over and done with quickly. We have plenty of HP for a deal with the devil, which is also great. Wow, look how much damage we're actually doing right here. And our rate of fire is not bad. We haven't had a, you know, a tears upgrade, but as Samson, of course, we just sort of start off with a great rate of fire. A decent rate of fire. We've got a rate of fire upgrade. It's also excellent. Oh, of course, our damage is going to go back down again. Oh my fucking god. We pretty much have to take it, don't we? <laughs> it's, I can't believe that it is only one red heart to pick that up. Take the moon card. See where our other secret room was. It's here. At least we can now benefit from batteries. If, you know, if ever we use the damn thing. And we'll pick up our chariot card just for shits and giggles, but... I don't really want to take that relaxed pill. I'm not going to spend the time shooting the poop. Six minutes, but... We've got ourselves a great start. If we start slowing down now, I'm going to be a bit upset with myself. Uh, yeah. Okay. It gives us a damage upgrade for doing it. And Pandora's box I might as well use now, because I'm not going to be taking it with me. It gave us the matchbook, which isn't... I don't know if it's a damage upgrade, but it gives plenty of bombs. And I do like bombs. They help, they help out quite a lot. So now we just whack this. Doofy doofy doo. And then we use this as much as we can. And then when it runs out, we go back and pick up all the stuff we left behind. Of course, this has ended a run before. I will... Don't let me forget that. Uh, I will definitely remind you. We were Judas and we had spikes and we walked on the spikes. And we died. Where are we going, by the way? Mom's heart. So we do want to think about how to get past the mom's heart fight. But it's not something to worry about right now. We'll use the temperance card. Straight away. Well, we can get sacks out of this. Oh, well, it's not wrong. Oh, blood back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is this is just, you know. Oh my god. And batteries. We can use Mega Blast again. This run has already popped off. This is outrageous. I hope everyone else has found all the things that I did. I don't know whether it's likely that they're difficult to discover. That I've just been very lucky, but I really suspect that everyone's going to be in the same boat. But this is so much fun. I feel like the game's making up for something, but I wasn't there for the thing it's making up for. Oh, we ran out. We might as well fight the boss and go back for the other stuff. We're not in any position to worry about how difficult this boss is going to be. Our rate of fire is great. Our damage is great, because we did find that um, temperance card, which gave us a blood bank. And our HP is great, and our personal speed is great, because well, it's, it's good, because the uh, blood bag does give you a slight speed upgrade, which is also excellent. Now, it would be nice to have a uh, slightly more reliable damage upgrade, but don't forget with all these sacks, we're getting all these batteries, and with all these batteries, we're getting all these Mega Blast plays, our tier damage is basically irrelevant. Deal with the devil, yes, please. More HP, we can spend it on a Krampus, whatever. I'm liable to take damage against Krampus, but maybe I'll not today. Today has been a great day for video games. Maybe it's because it's the start of the Steam sale? Or is that tomorrow? It's soon, anyway. Now we go back to our item room, and then we leave this floor barely a minute after we joined it. Sweet. We could go to the shop, but I think I'm not going to. Just want to go to the item room and see what it is. If the item room sucks, I might take myself off to the shop. No, it doesn't suck. It's the mind. We can find everything. <laughs> uh, I'm not going to... Uh, secret room's right there, so I should do it. We've got golden bombs, so there's no point really trying to save them. All we're saving is time at this stage. Okie dokie. Just a... Uh, jovial poop. Nothing to worry about too much. Now, where the hell is this going to be about here? That's where I meant to put it, honest. Well, we lose our golden bombs on the next floor, but to hell with the shop, it's too far away. Because we were charging around the place like a blue ass fly, because our uh, our ass was on fire. Speaking of blue ass flies, 
still doing a pretty decent amount of damage, even for not having any damage upgrades yet. Like, apart from the one we get from taking damage. So we'll fight this pride. See if we can get nine lives. Is pride nine lives? I think pride is nine lives. I'm trying to use a lump of coal here to uh, get as much of a benefit as we can. Oh, golden bombs again. Okay. <laughs> I mean, what are we expecting out of this run anymore? <clears throat> Let's do this secret room. Oh my god, this is synergizes with lump of coal. That's outrageous. See how it's getting bigger at the end? Yep. <clears throat> it's supposed to do that. Honest. Please. Oh, perfect. Deal with the devil again. Couldn't make it up. Now we can fly. <laughs> what is this game doing? <coughs> I can't I can't speak with my excitement. It's taken me away. I'm blown away. Perfect. Great. Brilliant. Now we get a look. This is tremendous. Outrageous. We can now fly so we can get this chest, which I presume we couldn't. That's right. Oh, a spirit heart. Thank you. Yeah, just ignore that uh, fucking... Ignore that coin, because who needs it, right? This game is already... We're already too strong on this game, so what we really need to do is not take single pennies, because that would be too much of an advantage for us. We're getting complacent, but, I mean, why the hell not? Sometimes you just need to. Uh, you do the duplex, of course. Yeah, sure. I'm happy with this as well. I think it actually literally widens your shots. It doesn't reduce the number of shots that you have. Great. Our uh, Mega Blast is recharged, so why the fuck not use it? We're going to get so many battery charges as a result of having them. Oh, I got hit. It's, it's silly. We shouldn't be getting hit. Stop now. It's 15 seconds before it goes away. Um, we shouldn't be worrying about anything on this run. Except maybe explosions. We're going to have so many battery charges from these sacks, but honestly, that why would I it. care? I'm going to keep the store credit. Speed up, fine. Chariot card again. Wheel of Fortune. Uh, sure. We'll see if we get anything out of it. Our luck stamp must be amazing. <laughs> I'm not going to spend any more money, I'm just going to explode it. See what you win. Sacks. What is happening? <laughs> Two of spades. Now we have 99 coins. Let's leave. I kind of want to keep one of the uh, one of those trinkets that we picked up, but also I'm perfectly happy to keep hold of the chariot card. Ah, man. Uh, sorry, the store credit. Just because we can get something good. Yep, down to the next floor at 11 minutes. I mean, we're not that fast, but we are constantly recharging Mega Blast, so really the only reason we're not that fast is um, because we have to keep backtracking from all the rooms that we just skipped with Mega Blast and couldn't do anything about. We should go to this mob trap room, though. Could do some good. I wouldn't mind getting an actual straight-up damage upgrade. Um, I think we'll find nothing so far has actually improved our base damage, so we have to take damage to do damage at this stage. And this is good. Oh, yeah, like that. Good, good demonstration. This is going to uh, be perfect timing because we get Mega Blast back just for this room. I think I can't pick anything up. Yeah. So now we have to sort of do all the rooms that we want to do and then come back. So we should basically make it happen as quickly as possible. Who cares about this card? I even know that that's not the secret room, so whatever. Now, when do you think we should pull the trigger on... Oh my god. <laughs> um, oh, I'm fucking... This is of bullshit. What's happening? Hang on. There's nothing for us. Um, when do you think we should pull the trigger on these self-sacrifice rooms is the question. Because at some point we're going to want to make sure we get past the mom's heart fight. We don't need to worry about hush. Fucking thanks for once. Um, oh, I hate this though. Oh, that was an <laughs> amazing shot, considering the momentum, the mechanics that had to go into that. Um, 
so we want to make basically I think our last opportunity let's get an AWAS rune our last opportunity for self-sacrifice rune which we're almost certainly going to be able to play is um <laughs> this is mom's heart uh, mom's mom's key oh thank you yes Temperance. uh with sack heaven it's just it's ridiculous what's happening Uh, we've got the world card, the world. which we can't really make anything out of. We've got the death card, which could be helpful. We've got the Empress card, which I quite like. So keep playing this. I don't want to spend too long on this, because we're going to miss boss rush. Okay, we don't need to worry about hush. But we do need to worry about boss rush. This is depth one, so we should be fine for that. But at the same time, we want to make sure we don't accidentally walk into the mom fight whilst faffing around with Mega Blast like this. Is it still going? Apparently yes. Apparently no. We're faster now because I picked up a blood bag. I was wondering whether I should. And the reason I was wondering whether I should is that um, it precludes us from getting into boss trap rooms quite considerably. Unless we happen to find another... Um, uh, I don't really want to. Unless we happen to find another blood bag. On the room, the, on the floor that has the boss trap room in it, otherwise we can't get into the boss trap room. Right? Oh, we can use a key since we've got infinite keys. And apparently we've got even more infinite keys right now than we had before. We'll take the steam sail because we may use it, I don't know. Load. Um, this is outrageous, it's very fast, it's very easy. We've got a basically infinite supply of everything we've ever wanted. I don't want the High Priestess card. What's this? Retro. Retrovision. The first bad thing that's happened to us. Well, take Bob's brain, because who gives a shit? Uh, we've got 91 cents, so our swag bonus is going to be amazing. Our exploration bonus is going to be slightly curtailed by the fact I haven't been to a couple of rooms on this floor, but we don't need to worry about getting to the boss. We know exactly where it is. I didn't pick up Jesus Juice because I was mega blasting at the time. But that's damage and range, so that's a, actually a base damage upgrade, which is something I did ask for. Not that it matters, because we just turn on Mega Blast and go. So here's a, a, like I was saying, there's a boss trap room right here. We can't get into it. Oh yeah, don't forget you got Bob's brain now. Ah, that's also not bad, but not great. <laughs> okay. We just recharge that. Note that the, um, the batteries don't do as much for Mega Blast as they do for basically everything else. Which is a, a balancing uh, concern, I assume. A priestess. Empress, Hermit. We might as well Hermit card when we get tired of our lot. Can't actually do anything with this, but I don't really care because there's lots of batteries around, so I'm just going to faff around doing this instead of, you know, making the best of the situation. Come on. Let me have this card. High Priestess. What a waste of time. There's so many batteries, and I feel like I'm sort of slightly cheapening everything by uh, using Mega Blast all the fucking time. Maybe we use the Hermit to get out of a curse room? Is there a curse room? We can bomb our way into this boss trap room actually, so not having a blood bank is also fine. There's also no arcade, which is less great. Now when we're not actually uh, using Mega Blast, we seem to take some time, so we need to make sure we're still budgeting our time correctly. So we should make it make our way towards the boss. Man, I should have just picked up them there. Batteries and like plowed through these rooms too, but no, we've got to at least play this game with some skill. I'm slowly running out of things to actually say. I've got half the spirit heart down, so obviously I'm doing really badly right now. Guppy? Take the um flies around that thing, it makes it super difficult to actually pick. Judgment. judgment. Not a demon judgment. A hangman does nothing. Brother Bobby is pretty shit, so for once we get something I don't really care about. We'll go into the super secret room. It is an eternal heart, sure. I mean, we may spend it in order to play a blood bank, but I think that's a reasonable sacrifice. I'm not coming back to that super secret room just to pick up an eternal heart at the min maxis of opportunities. So, who cares? Go to the shop. Might as well hermit into the shop, to be fair. And then come back. I guess it doesn't matter which way you do it. 
saves us a whole... Ooh, still got this. I'll take this. I like spider mod. And everything else is really cheap. But, um... Spider mod's great. It just... I like being able to see how nearly dead the enemies are. Pretty much. And that's the entire reason why I take it. The fact that it does the status effect to uh, enemies when it walks over them is kind of completely secondary. In fact, it is completely, completely secondary. I couldn't really care less about that. Although sometimes on weaker runs, it has been a huge benefit to us. Pardon me? It's actually good. <laughs> that's a miss. Not too concerned that we actually just wasted the entirety of that because there's going to be battery charges abound. Yep, open these. Nine lives. Well, <laughs> it's interesting. And we do have an eternal heart and we've got plenty of HP and we're quite likely to get a deal with Devil actually. So I think we take nine lives. Simply because it's interesting. Also, the eternal hearts that we're getting as a result of Sackboy is. Pretty ridiculous. Bad trip. Bad trip. It is not great, but that's okay. Empress is nice enough. Magician is not that useful. Relax is also not that useful. Let's take our shit and leave. La la la. Mom fight then. Done everything? Done everything. There's another spirit heart, but it's so min maxi away that I'm not going to do it. We use the Empress here. Maybe I should have used it on the boss rush, but I'd like to get two boss rush in order for that to be an option. I don't forget, a boss rush will basically pay for itself as soon as uh, bop, bop, ring, bop, bop, ring. soon. Ooh. Uh, a few run, a few waves have gone by. Will be, you know, not even thinking about boss rush anymore because ah, uh, hit it. We're not actually hitting the fucking. Hit the bottom, there we go. It's not going to be Krampus, so we have time. I'm not going to take everyone. Oh, fuck. Did it go? Did it go? We should have taken the shovel. Even though it would have made this take forever. Because it would have got us through the next two floors. Which one do you take? I think we take Procto uh, Polyphemus. Strange as that may seem. Because we can hide behind rocks and beat the crap out of enemies. and It's just so strong. Uh, Polyphemus, please not Polycephalus. Fuck okay. off. Okay. See, now we're on Mega Buster. So we do this and we wait. That's why I wanted to keep it. Unfortunately, we can't get to that deal with the devil because it would allow us to get past Mom's heart. But I guess we're hoping for an AWAS rune. We at least know where all the... Um... <laughs> it's just taking no time. It's amazing. It uh, tells us where the super secret runes are. Oh, we've got that Bob's Brain. Don't forget about Bob's Brain. You've got to be careful. And the super secret runes could contain runes and therefore the runes could be an AWAS rune. So... It's pretty much, uh, if we're going to get a way out, it's going to be that. I mean, once we got into boss rush, which was just in time considering how strong this run was, but I guess I did spend the time to make sure that we did as much as we could whilst we had something as strong as Mega Blast to get us through the rooms. Um, watch out here. The bloke is no joke, and of course... We are in a position where we have to, uh... Oh, thank you. We can't use Mega Blast to deal with this wave, which is unfortunate. So be it. Oh, you jumped on top of me. Fair enough. Where did that come from? Not that I'm complaining, but where did it come from? Is this a uh, champion's boss rush? I don't think it is. Please, there we go. Got our HP back on the next floor, which is also pretty nice. So 21 minutes and we've finished boss rush, 20 minutes and we got into it in the first place. I don't really care about Magneto, but I've taken it anyway. Uh, and that's it, we can't do anything else on this floor, so we'll go. Unfortunately, because obviously the shovel was our ticket to doing more stuff, and even if we do have Mega Blast, I'm pretty sure doing one more floor is way... Ah. In terms of pure amount of this is mad lulls, having Mega Blast is the best. In terms of points and doing more stuff, Cool card, world card. World. Neither of them really does anything for us. In terms of having more points at the end and, you know, doing well. Fudge. Yeah, I didn't say fudge. Uh, we're better off taking the shovel. I mean, at this stage, we're going to Oh, <laughs> I nearly went completely wrong. 
we open any of these? No. Ah, uh, that's a pest. That's, it's fine. It's just a pest. Because it's going to be a boss room because we're down in the womb. So it's a bit of a bugger that you can't open them, but at the same time, I mean, you can't really be salty. It's like, <laughs> you can't complain that your Mega Blast is not working. Or it's got balancing uh, mechanics to prevent you from cheesing up completely. Stop following me. I've got nine lives. Maybe we should save up Spirit Hearts and then use our Suicide King card. Get some extra items, see what we win. It's dangerous. Oh, that was really bad. Excuse me? Where did that come from? Ooh. Awas? Blank room. Could be Awas. Counterfeit Penny. Still not seeing my uh, requisite spirit hearts that allow me to use Suicide King. What's this? The world. world. We'll take Suicide King and try not to press Q by accident. I am now checking for Tinted Rocks and anything that could provide us with those few extra spirit hearts. Because we could just take Suicide King and then Mega Blast our way through the rest of the floor until we get a spirit heart. But I'd like to have at least one available to us so that we don't completely fuck it up. Which I think is a reasonable... Um... Excuse me? Do you not have a, an effect on you that prevents you from doing that? I think it's a reasonable suggestion. Well, we'll Mega Blast anyway, I guess. Uh, except we won't, because now this is going down. There's rooms that are completely count that completely counter Mega Blast, which is a bit of a shame because I'm running very quickly out of HP as a result. But having all the battery charges, I suppose, kind of counteracts the fact that Mega Blast is bad in some situations. Wouldn't mind a hero Judge thank God. Judgment, give me some HP upgrade and then I'll use my suicide king. And if you can pay out with spirit hearts as well, sort of in the interim. Dude, you're really not helping. Bruh. Dude, bruh. 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 Ooh. That'll do it. So we'll use our suicide king just before we go down to the next floor and then we'll. Oh, I'm, so, I'm a bit slower than I anticipated just now. Um, we'll come back to that room, pick that up, and then immediately go down to the Justice. next floor. Uh, try not to accidentally go down. I fucking left the room by accident because I was being pushed backwards by Mega Blast. See, this thing has so many dangers to it. You just want to think. Okay. Suicide. We're still using it. <laughs> it's still going. Stop. Good. Libra, I've taken. I didn't want to, but I did. And it actually gave us some spirit hearts anyway, so that was really nice. Kind of hoping for some more items and Addictive. not so much in the way of uh, stuff. Well, <laughs> Cursed Eye is an item, I understand. But it's not, not what I was thinking of. Uh, the Lovers does really nothing. The Lovers. Not great. Addicted. Don't really want to use. I'm just going to leave... Let's go and get that blank rune in case it's AWAS. At the very last minute, it could turn out to be an AWAS rune that wins the game and sort of justifies... Well, pays for the fact that I... Of course, we got Libra, didn't we? So we're now quite fast. But our damage has gone down, but our rate of fire has gone way up because of Polyphemus, right? Libra balances all your stats. And because Polyphemus was a tiers downgrade, but huge damage upgrade, we've now got sort of normal tiers, which could actually do quite a lot of damage. Health up there as well, okay. We'll take this then. So now we've got three HP. We picked up Libra and Crackjacks, but whatever. Which I think gave us a spirit heart. Um, got Libra, got Crackjacks. So we'll see how much damage we're doing. We're not one-shotting dips. <laughs> this is bullshit. Fuck it then. That's not going to be much use for us. Ooh, although we could hope to get an arcade. Please. Uh, a blood bank in the arcade. Which is basically why we go to arcades. 
Samson, of course. I mean, damage is not terrible, especially with um, Spider Mod telling us how much more hits we need to do to actually get the son of a bitch to die. It's kind of palatable. I think I'll spend the spirit heart to get out of here. This is awkward with um, Bob's Rotten Head, because you don't know when Bob's Rotten Head is going to hit. Judgment. Uh, yeah, HP, please. I mean, I'm picking up all these coins, but we've been at 99 cents since forever, so there's really no point in doing so. <sighs> Pills, puberty, wow. <laughs> was worth the 30 points. Uh, we'll open all the stuff that we went by. Money. Stuff. I mean, I don't mind the stuff. We're going to be at 99 of everything by the end of this. Pretty nice, but I oh, can't get into there. We'll open this chest, though. Spirit Heart actually really helps at this stage. And then we'll go into here and see what we win. Uh, it does have what we anticipated, so that's pretty nice. Maybe we won't go too hard on it, though, because... I guess we can't. There's a limit. I don't think... Oh, I could be wrong. I don't think that the damage that you would take, except for the fact you're invincible, counts it. It's not, doing, it's not damaging. It's literally not damaging us. I expect that does not count towards uh, the bloody lust. But we can go into this. Yes, we're going to the mob trap. Let's try. Boom. Die. Die. Lol. We win. GG. I right, just need to uh, vomit past here. Get these rooms out of the way. Yeah, good. Die. Oh. Well, re-roll. <laughs> That's me. It is a fucking re-roll. Oh, fuck. All right, here's what happens. Ooh, didn't see that. Here's how this works. We beat Mom's heart without Mega Blast because it ran out. We couldn't get between the boss trap room and Mom's heart. Oh, everything gets damn Because of Libra, the damage upgrade that we get... Oh! As a result of um, playing the Blood Bank becomes an all-stats upgrade. So, blank rune, a was Yera. Yera. Fuck you. Reroll. <laughs> we can cut the mom transformation. We're really slow. We can't fly anymore. Although, everything has changed. Mysterious paper. a was rune. a was rune. Apparently, we still have amazing... Oh, my God. <laughs> Turns out we have uh, Dr. Fetus. <laughs> Yay. Nah, this is it. This is done. Oh, let's... Look. Never say never. We've got Scatter Bombs, Dr. Fetus, Butt Bombs. So one bomb to finish off a room. Oh, shit. And us. Apparently we've got nine more lives, or a ninth life, so somehow we've managed to acquire those... Uh, something that will give us uh, one more life. I mean, it's pretty nice because uh, all the bombs are butt bombs and therefore they damage everything on the floor. Look, just give me that AWAS rune that I so strongly desire and make up for the fact that I didn't. Good job. Didn't take um. <laughs> didn't take uh, the, the fucking look. I can't think because I don't know what's happening. I didn't take the shovel, which was the coolest thing to have got done. I'm trying to use my technology shots, but I also don't want to because our bombs are coming out so fast. God, I hate it. <laughs> Let me out. I've done my time. Explosive diarrhea. Great. Well, we'll go and collect our trophy. It was worth a try. There could have been an AWAS rune. The reroll was mildly entertaining. The entire run was great fun because it was press spacebar and win. But it didn't get us past this floor, which was the main goal. There isn't even a self-sacrifice room, so we take our trophy. See where we came. 215th, not bad. I mean, obviously, if we had taken that shovel, we could have got that up a bit. 
But at the same time, maybe we would have taken way more damage as a result of not having had Mega Blast. Maybe we would not even, uh, we would have got to boss rush because that was the boss rush time. But there we are. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did. And if you did, don't forget to possibly subscribe and share the video with your friends and tell them how cool you found it because this is amazing and you loved it. But until the next episode, thank you for watching and I'll see you.